Hello, this is the Epic Quinn, and welcome back to Fez. Now, um, what, what, what's this? Oh, snap, I found a secret two seconds into the episode. All right, cool. Well, um, I just found a secret two seconds into the episode. So, yeah. Um, yeah, welcome back to Fez, which is, like, the best game ever made. Um, I really hope you guys are liking this series so far. Um, I don't know if you guys are watching, or if I'm gonna be posting this, like, um, a, a day after my, uh, the, you know, I posted my last Fez episode, but, uh, usually I don't, or usually I record, like, a Fez episode, like, once a week, but, um, I'm recording another one today, even though I recorded one yesterday, because, uh, I have really been enjoying myself playing this game, so where am I right now? Where am I? Okay. Okay, I know where I am. I know where I am. Um. Alright, let's get back home. I've already explored this area before. Um, so let's go back. I did not know that that shortcut was there, but I guess it is. And that's, that's cool. And the universe is, is still broken. Okay, so let's actually... Last time we unlocked the... Wait, no, but first... First... Where was that block puzzle area? Because now that I know how to beat that, I can beat that block puzzle. Um, if I can actually figure out where it is. Um, I don't know where it is. Huh. Okay, whatever. Let's go back to here and we can go and explore the four cube area, which we discovered last time. And we went, kind of went into the first area of it and uh, didn't do anything. So we're about to do something, though. Um, is this it? I think this is it. Pretty sure. Um, let's find out. So hopefully this won't be too laggy. I mean, it wasn't really lagging that much before, but I mean, yeah, this is it. This is it. All right, let's uh, let's do this. I'm I'm hyped for this episode. Fez. Oh, this game is just. The best game ever made. Like, honestly. Oh, this game is so good. Um. Okay, so looks like there's no cubes down here. But, ooh, snap. Let me, uh, let me go into this building right quick. Are you gonna kill me, Mr. Caterpie? Okay, so looks like you can't change perspective inside of these little buildings. Um. Huh. Interesting. So, they're flat and stuff, so you can't really change perspective inside of them, which is kind of interesting, um, except not really, I guess, just a new game mechanic. So where are we right now? If you look behind us, it looks like, um, like inside of something, so, ooh, what's that? Um, he looks like he has four nipples or something, okay. Oh, no, 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 that's people bowing down to someone. Oh, those weren't nipples, those were, those were people. <laughs> okay, so people were bowing down to someone. Um, I bet, uh, these are gonna tell a story, maybe? I don't know. Um, huh, there's nothing in here, no, of those none of that right and yo. Um, okay, right quick. Let me go up here. Um, just make sure that there's no other ways that I can climb up. Oh, oh my god. Um, I'm st- wait, wait, wait. Okay, no, that's where I entered, that's where I entered. I thought I found some secrets, but I didn't. I don't think this Fez episode is going to be as long as the other ones. Um, but, you know, I, I'm on a bit of a time crunch. Um, because I've been recording so many YouTube videos today, and this is probably going to be my last one to record. I mean, I'm probably not going to post them all in one day, but today I recorded, like, five YouTube videos. Um, oh, wow, this entire room is broken, look. This entire room, like, like, look at that. Oh my god. Okay. We are getting out of there. Um, nope. N to the, O to the, P to the E. When you see me, I will splee. Um, okay, so where does this do anything? Is that, is this, like, literally the entire, like, four area? That, that's it? Wow. Okay, so, um, wait, was, did I just go into this one? Was this the broken one? Oh, no, that wasn't. No, that wasn't. So, where do we go? 
I feel like I should be doing something with this giant totem pole man. Uh, don't take that out of context. Um, huh. What, how do I, how do I do the giant totem pole dude? Um, oh, Hunter's gonna give me an Phobos. Okay. Um, alright. What, how do I, is there something that I'm supposed to be doing? That, that, like, what do I do? How do I make that jump? Okay, well, apparently I survived that. Um, okay. Where, I guess that's, that's the four area. You're, you're welcome. Um, that was, that wasn't very long, but okay. I guess that was just supposed to kind of give you some insight on, um, what was going on. So, uh, here we go. We also unlocked the eight area, which hopefully is, is a bit bigger. Um, I don't know if it is or not, but, I mean, let's, uh, Let's find out. Ooh, ooh, snap. I've never seen... What? What's this? Oh, it's the owl. Did you see that? The picture of an owl? There's an Easter egg in this game where if you can find, like, all four talking owls. Or was it, like, all eight or something? But if you can find all the talking owls, then, um... Then, like, something crazy happens. I don't remember what it was, but... Look at that. Oh, it's so weird. This isn't the, uh, the, the spooky area. I've never been in this area before. Oh, look at this. This is so cool. Look at the design. Oh, my God. Oh, this place is so cool. But what I'm wondering, if this place was two-dimensional before, right? And I'm the only one that can switch between dimensions. All the other objects are just bending to my will. Then... How did they make these objects in three dimensions if they can only see and um, interact with objects in two dimensions? So, I mean, that it just kind of sparked that question in my mind. I don't know, that was just something that I was wondering. Because, um, you know, like, if you saw that shop before, you know, like, look, it was it's two, two dimen or three dimensions. Like, look at that, right? But, I mean, I'm the only one that can, like, bend reality and stuff. They can't do that. So, how did they build that? I guess it's just the insane Illuminati, um, restaurant. Um, okay. That does nothing. Oh, I just love all the detail in this game. I know whatever is made by, oh, it's Party Eagle again. Woo woo. I know it was, like, made by some guy that absolutely everybody, like, hates and despises and stuff, but, um... I'm not gonna lie, this game is one of the best games I've ever played. Like, I mean, yeah, it's not like the most extensive or whatever. <gasps> oh, snap. They were learning about three dimensions, but how is that possible? Because remember, they only believed in two dimensions. So... So why are they learning about three dimensions? Like, honestly, um... I don't know the story of the place that I'm in right now, or even if there is a story of why there's this crazy building out in this warped area of, um, you know, the, the multiverse, whatever dimension we're in now, because, I mean, we're entering, like, different dimensions and stuff. Um, whatever area of the multiverse this is in, then, um, I don't know, like, what's the story? Is there even a story? Because before in the, in the area with the four cubes, you know, um, you know, that had, like, whatever, people bowing down to that god or whatever. And, you know, there's a bit of a story, but this is just, it's a creepy abandoned building. And then there was also a restaurant, but it was just in the middle of absolutely nowhere. Like, look, we're floating in the middle of, like, actually absolutely nowhere. Like, people are asking where I am, and I am, I am in nowhere. Oh my god, that owl is creepy. Um, okay. So look at that. Oh, hey, that's the, uh, Pixel Polytron. I think that is the the company that, uh, developed this game or whatever. Polytron. I think that's, that's, uh, what they were called. So what do I, uh, what do I do with this? All up in this. What do I, what does I do? See, I feel like this, this shouldn't be a dead end, but I think it is, like, 
I think that's just like a, a dead end, maybe? I don't know. And, okay. Um, okay, if I go down there. Yeah, because look, that's just like a, a dead end. What the heck? Stop it, Mr. Pixel Man. You just, you just fell off a building into infinite space. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. Stop being such a baby. Okay. Um... Is that, like, actually the entire 8 area, though? Like, is that it? There has to be more to all of this, though. Like, like there's, like, nothing. Like, literally, there's one room for each of these things, and, and that's, that's it. I haven't gotten to this one yet. What's this one? Was this one? Is this... Oh, that's the four. Okay, so, wait, there's- that was the four, the other one's the eight. But there was one more, right? So this is... No, stop. I, I never said to go in there. Mr. Fez, come on. What, what, he, what are you doing, Mr. Fez man? Um, so I go back out here. So that's the four area. Um, right? And this is eight. So then, what's this? Was this? Is this the, oh, this is the area that we started in, okay. That's the one that we started in. Okay, so, yeah, I guess that's, that's all there is to explore over there for now. I really thought there would be more. I honestly thought there would be a lot more, like, you know, like how we discover the absolutely huge area. Uh, in this door, but there's, there's, no, like, nothing in any of the other ones, so, like, we just, like, as soon as I started up the episode, I found a, I found a secret, and secrets are cool. Um, so it looks like there's still a bunch of secret areas that we can discover over here. Um, how do I, okay, there's that, and, uh, let me climb up here, and, uh, see what this building has to offer. Um, let's, let's find out. Um, let's go in here, and what is this? Oh, I haven't done this yet! I haven't done this yet at all. Actually, I think that I am going to save this for the next video, because this, this is pretty cool. And, um, I'm glad that we are able to explore those areas in that video today. Or in this video today, but, um, I don't know. I feel like I'm going to save this bigger explore for the next video since, again, I said I'm on a pretty big time crunch. So for now, I guess if you liked those areas, that took us, like, the entire game to unlock those areas, they're pretty small, but I bet there's a deeper meaning behind them that we will probably find out about soon enough. So if you like this video, why not leave a like? And if you're leaving a like, why not subscribe? And as always, see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.